I got another box in the mail. This time the box is not a square box, it is a rectangular box, and man, it's heavy. Hey guys, it is Joshua, the geocaching vlogger, and I have a little bit different video for you today. I have another unboxing video. Some of you guys really like these videos. Some of you guys like to see the kind of geocaching mail that I get. And this one is from an awesome company called coinsandpins.com. They sent me a huge, I repeat, huge haul of trackable items. And they also sent me a restocking of my geocaching vlogger patches. Let's open this bad boy. Oh, yes, you guys. <laughs> for those of you that have been watching my channel for a while, you know that Coins and Pins not only sells coins, but they also make custom patches and a whole lot of other stuff. And it's Coins and Pins that have been making my rubber patches and these patches are just for my patrons those that support me on patreon.com there they are it's beautiful not only can you stick these on maybe a geocaching bag but they also stick really well to the refrigerator and they're not even magnetic so thank you coins and pins i am restocked if you want one of these become a six dollar more month patron that'd be awesome Okay, so the first one is a geocoin, and it is called the Crazy Chameleon Geocoin, and it, everything here is super, super trackable, and it's so cool. All these coins are so colorful. This one's kind of a greenish, sort of blue, and its eyeball has this like little thing that sticks out, and also has this like kind of spiky back to it. All right, next one. Sticking with the animal theme, I don't think I have ever seen a geocoin quite like this. This, check this out. It is a jellyfish geocoin. Has little jellyfish tendrils to it and it has on the back, it looks like it has jellyfish on it. Again, super colorful. Remember on Finding Nemo? You totally got through the jellies, man. So cool. All right, sticking with the theme of animals, this is not a geocoin, uh, but it is trackable. This is like a trackable patch. It is the travel sea turtle, um, like patchy thing, but it's also super trackable. It's got a turtle on it. Go check out the jellies, man. It's rubber, it's trackable. My patches are not trackable, so it's really cool to have a patch that actually is trackable. All right, now we're gonna get into all the round geocoins. The cool thing about these, these are not just geocoins, but these are like works of art, all right? So we have two series of compass rose geocoins, and they all sort of have their the same design on one side in different colors, but then the other side it has something like special on it. So this is the El Dorado compass geocoins. One side you can see is the actual compass rose design, and then the other side, there's like a little scene of El Dorado. El Dorado, why don't you come to your senses? All right, sorry, I know it's not a, I know it's Desperado, but um, beautiful coin. And it also has like green jewels on it as well. <laughs> this one is for all you dinosaur fans out there. I've got two dinosaur geocoins. This is called Bone Wars. Da -da -da, da -da, da -da -da, da -da. All right, so the first version is the black nickel version. On one side, it says Bone Wars, has an intimidating dinosaur on it. And then the other side has the actual bones of the dinosaur. How cool. Uh, this one's a silver version. It's the same design on this side, but it's all silver. And then uh, a little bit different colors on the other side. I have two sets of five Compass Bros geocoins. And I'm gonna go through them pretty quickly. So one set has just like a standard colors, colors of the Compass Bros. The other one has like jewels on it. They're like bedazzled, like bedazzled jeans. Only like bedazzled jeans. Let's face it, they're not that cool. But these are cool. There's the design. Isn't it awesome? This one is a blue one. Awesome. And then, check it out, we got more. We got a red and gold version of it. And then we got a silver, red, and green version. We have an orange, ooh, I think I like this one the most. It matches my geocaching vlogger shirt. 
right there. It is orange and red and yellow. And then we got the green and gold. It's so shiny, so beautiful. Beautiful works of art. The other side of these coins has sort of like a pirate ship sort of thing. On each corner, there's like a bear, uh, a bear on one corner, a fox, an owl, and I think that's like some sort of like walrus, maybe? But they all have like a ship on the other side, all about navigation. Because you know, geocaching, it's about navigation. It's about getting places. And maybe these coins will help you get places. Maybe. I don't know. All right. And now you need to see the bejeweled, dazzled ones with the actual jewels on it. Oh my gosh. Here's the orange one with diamonds in it. Probably not real diamonds. That's okay. So cool. We got another one with, with rubies. Oh, rubies in it? And green. Oh, so beautiful. Oh, this one. This one kind of has like an Aztec feel to it. It's uh, orange-ish and red. Beautiful. This one, oh my gosh, this one's intense. Oh, I just noticed. I just noticed that there's a little moon. There's a little moon in all of these in the middle. Little moon guy. This one kind of has a winter feel to it. It's kind of like a light blue. All right, let's look at the other side. The other side again has the ship on it. If you can see, it has the zodiac signs all the way around it too, in different colors. These things, are awesome and I think they're sold as sets. This next one is not so much a geocoin but it's like geocaching sculpture art and it came in its own little box. Great things come in little boxes, right? Let's open it. Ah. All right? Oh, paper! Paper! That means it's fragile. That's that's French for fragile. Along the animal theme, this thing is called a, a praying mantis and it's actually um, trackable as well. I'm gonna see if I can get him out. There he is. Oh my gosh. Look at him. Oh my gosh, look at him. He has like movable little front arms and he's got legs and look at those, look at those green beady eyes. The tracking number is on his belly. <laughs> I have never had in my possession a trackable like sculpture. Um, I don't think I would put this in a geocache. I don't, actually, I don't know if I'd put any of this stuff in a geocache. Maybe, maybe the turtle, cause it's like more of a rubber thing. But if you're like in the market for getting some really beautiful trackable geocoins and stuff like that, check out coinsandpins.com. Um, everything I showed you, I'm gonna put a link of it in the description below here on YouTube. Go over there and check them out because when you support their store, you support what we do here on YouTube and that's really awesome. Another way you can support us is becoming a patron at patreon.com slash geocaching vlogger. Everybody that supports us at $6 more a month will get this patch, also a path tag, and we also have GeoChallenge Geocoins if you'd like to support us at maybe even a higher level. We really appreciate all our patrons and, and everything they do to support what we do here on YouTube and Facebook and all the other places. You might be asking, Josh, what are you gonna do with all these coins? Well, I'm gonna keep some of them because they're really cool and I really wanna add some of these to my collection. However, I don't think I'm gonna keep all of them. So here's the deal, if I still have them with me, um, if you are a patron and I meet you at a geocaching event, I'm gonna bring some of these along with me and if you walk up to me and say, hey Josh, good to see you, good to meet you, I'm a patron, I just might give you one of these coins, why not? If this is the first time watching any of our videos, make sure you click the subscribe box right down there. You don't wanna miss any of our ventures as we bring joy to the world, one geocaching video at a time. Thanks for watching.